It was a perfect July beach day. July 2016, fresh from my recent surgery, leaning on my walker on the pavement just above the rocky sand, I surveyed the beach below. There were about a dozen people, children mostly, building sand castles and playing in the gently swishing waves. They were enjoying this stretch of Woodmont Beach. I closed my eyes. I inhaled deeply. I exhaled slowly. And I breathed in the saltwater smell of my childhood days. And I did not cry. Strengthened by this victory, I turned to face the beach houses behind me. They had grown even more enormous since the childhood days of my romping in them in the 50s and 60s. There was Charlie's house. His family was one of the few that lived year-round on Beach Street. I swore I could hear the guitar chords he played as he serenaded Benita and me. We'd sit on his colossal wraparound porch, and he sat in that once white wicker chair, ceramic dolphin anchored just above his head. Where was Charlie now, I wondered. Benita would know. <laughs>